of driving is that? Going right in the middle of the road, the green light. My mom asked if I could find these dry dandelion leaves. I believe some people use it for things like tea and so forth. I'll be surprised if places are open here. Credit card, you have a credit card? Baby. Okay. Two options. Whichever one works. Cash. Cash? Cash. Good. <laughs> Funny thing is I usually pay in credit card just because you get things like cash back points and stuff like that But I know usually these small stores they don't have it just because they get I guess dinged like a processing fee so That's usually why for these places I bring cash often although right now as you can see a lot of people are afraid to handle cash It seems at least I found my mom what she needed, but man, that's kind of crazy, huh? Just that adjustment with all the merchants and stuff
Just a quick note, I think that manual white balance helps a lot. It looks a lot better to me personally, just from the preview so far. Quick thing I read today which makes you think again about that quick shift in mindset when it comes to things like drone tech. Read this one here. It says, Coronavirus and parks enlist drones to monitor crowds at Bukit Taman Nature Reserve. On Thursday morning, April 9th at about 9.45 a.m., a drone rose slowly from the summit of Bukit Taman Nature Reserve in the heart of Singapore. The drone hovered just about 50 meters overhead, offering a bird's eye view of the crowd gathered at the clearing at the top of the hill before descending back underground where it was picked up by officers from the National Park Boards. The N Parks is tapping technology to help monitor visitorship at certain parks and nature areas in Singapore, saying, quote, a total of 30 drones will be deployed in selected parks and nature areas that are larger with more ground to cover. So apparently in these areas with, I guess, a lot of nature, animals and stuff like that, they're actually using the drone to monitor people to make sure they keep their distance, like the social distancing. Just think about that. A few weeks or months ago, everyone was saying things like, oh, these things are crazy. They'll basically disrupt, I guess, all the wildlife, the dangers around people, yet now they're using it like it's normal. You guys remember, apparently they closed down the roads here too, from cars. Let's see how it's like, huh? Am I reading this right too? You guys said you don't see flowers bloom in Ontario? Really? Well, how about this? Here's a bunch of plants and flowers and stuff like that while I'm here. I'm cheer. Looks like they're putting up those signs that says seawall closed to bicycles.
Alright, see you guys later.